Hello all my past, present, and future parents of this video. Unless if you don't want kids or you're already a parent, then you're, you're the present. The video I want to show you guys is Parenting 101. What to not do as a parent. What examples to show your kids. This family of three, maybe more, I don't know, they just brought their eldest daughter. This family of three wanted to go to a restaurant. That's all fine and dandy. My family go to restaurants all the time, if that's shocking. The difference between my family and this family is that they they caused a scene and my family ate food. Okay, uh, let's just cut to the chase. I don't really know what else to say with this. I just think I needed to show you guys. Well, she don't need to be coming okay, over but you don't need to be throwing stuff. 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 You don't need to be throwing so this is what I'm getting here. One, this daughter is a mess. I don't know how he even gets like that. Soon on, you'll see her mouth is covered with barbecue sauce, not barbecue, like hot sauce and shit. And you can literally see her hands covered with hot sauce. Tip number one for all my parents watching, don't let your kids eat like animals. Don't let your kids eat like pigs. You can let that happen at home. I don't really care how you guys eat at home. Maybe it's some traditional shit, but in public, there are standards. And if you don't want your kids to end up like an outcast, then maybe you should teach them some manners. But that was lesson number one. Yeah, I'm actually giving parenting tips. I'm 15, by the way. <laughs> Man, as you see, this masculine, masculine father just, he wanted to express himself very subtly, so he flipped the entire table. You know, it would have been really embarrassing if that table was like attached to the ground, he was just trying to flip it over that entire time. I don't know, that was like the first thing I thought of when I saw that. Oh no, I guess he's done that before. You can see the other table over there flipped over. Wherever this family goes, there's carnage and chaos. You know, this is a really nice looking restaurant, but they just ruined it. They ruined all of it because their daughter got called a bitch. Which is not good. Like, I guess tip number three, if... Hi. Hey, Zane, I'm recording Wait. a video. Oh. Yeah. Why are you gonna use a Roblox video thing? Oh, I'm already, like, ten entries in. Mm. Out of can I do the next? Yeah, you can do... I don't know, you can do one soon, but I am recording right now, okay, then? Okay. You wanna play later? On Fortnite? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we can play Reload though, duos. They added a duos version. Oh, okay. We can play later. Did you know that? Well, added a duos version? Now I know. Love you, Zane. Love you. Hey, guys, I think you can listen to me now. My brother Lily just came in the room and I politely asked him to leave. These parents can never do that. They're gonna just be yelling at him. <laughs> uh, dude, what was the third thing? What was the third thing I was gonna teach? Dude, if I ever get caught like cursing around my parents, well, I cursed one time and I found out. I don't want to get to the specifics, but I found out real quick. Lesson number four, how to properly protect your children. Because, I don't know, maybe that employee, actually, I would not be shocked if that employee actually called her a bitch or some shit. Because, I don't know, I feel like she was just eating like that. I feel like all this started with how she was eating and how she had no manners with how she was eating. With something like that, I feel like you should just leave the restaurant just immediately. I recommend you pay. If you don't, then you would probably get in trouble. I don't know, these guys probably didn't pay. With stuff like that, you need to remain calm. Not for yourself, but for your child. I'm so good with advice, bro. Why am I so good with advice? You already leaving. You already like open. Real quick, I just want to mention this manager eight. Yeah, this manager is not taking any bullshit, and I respect that so much. And she's making sure they leave because I, I don't like I don't know what was happening before. I just know with how the family is behaving, whatever happened before is not excusing their actions now. Okay guys, I have two things to say right there. One, I think I might be able to actually show what happened there. Because there was no hitting or nothing. They were just kind of pushing each other. 
I'll probably would just have to put this video on educational, but that's what I always do. I think I can actually show the entire clip in its entirety. Even though these parents are not very mature, they at least know to keep their hands to themselves most of the time. I don't know what they were doing there. I don't know why they did that. Why they were just pushing the doors back. They were already leaving, so. And number two, Dream. That is crazy. Dream is watching all of this unfold. I bet that is not a stunning new joke i bet if that dude is watching this video that it's not funny at all i bet all of his friends call him dream all the time because he, he actually looks exactly like him let's see i don't know maybe that's like actually dream maybe that is legit dream right there where are we on now four tip number five as a parent don't be a twat <laughs> don't be a bloody idiot mate <laughs> i don't know why i just turned british there always give people respect lead like genuinely leave a good example for your children so they don't make mistakes you might have done in the past actually lead by example i don't know i feel like parents are just getting worse and worse and worse if you and your family eat like how they were eating at home i don't know that's at home that doesn't really matter at all but in public like you gotta expect your kid to be treated like that because there are different social norms around the world i don't know if that's like genuinely a tradition thing i really doubt it i don't know why i even think it's a tradition thing they were just their daughter was the only one even eating like that but i don't know maybe none of this even happened because of that maybe the employee straight up just called the daughter a bitch for no reason and if that's the case then fire the employee and give the manager a raise so guys there's nothing else to be said so goodbye